Hello and welcome, thank you for tuning in. So in today's video, I am bringing you a bra review. I've not done one of these for quite some time, so I thought I would do one. And before I get into the review, I would like to ask you to please like and subscribe. It really helps the channel out. And I want to help all the, every woman try and find her perfect fit. So back to the review. I am reviewing the Freya Offbeat Bra. So before I get started, I have to say I am not sponsored for this review. Now, if you've watched some of my older videos, you'll have seen me do reviews on a mannequin. But I thought I was gonna, I'm gonna take it a step further. I am going to be the mannequin. So I am trying out this bra on myself. My measurements are, I am a 30F UK or 30G US. And I've actually got the Freya Offbeat on at the moment. And I thought, I wanna test it, I wanna wear it, I wanna see what it feels like. So I can give you my honest opinion on this bra. And to start with, I am one of those people that loves a t-shirt bra. I love a seam-free molded cup. It's just easy for me to wear. I don't have to think about what I'm wearing with it. So this is a little bit of a departure for me because the offbeat has lots of lace. In fact, it's covered in lace. So I was like, oh, how is this gonna look under close fitting tops? Am I gonna be able to see the lace, the trim, and it's also not my favorite color. This color is beautiful. My favorite color is black. <laughs> I always wear black, which again is because it's the closest I can get to skin tone. It takes a thought process out of it for me. And it's what I wear on a day-to-day -day basis. I save color for special occasions or if I'm just feeling that kind of colorful mood. So I've got the offbeat on, I've had it on all day at this point and I have to start by talking about the coverage. So this, the one I've got on is the side support model and it's just a full lace cup and my initial thoughts were, is this lace going to be itchy? And it's not, it, I think there must be some kind of lining on the inside of the cups because I can't feel this bra at all. And looking at it, it is a three part cut and sew cup. So there are seams all over the front of this cup and that's to give you support and to give you that side support, that lift to bring your breasts together and up, which is really what we're all looking for. Especially with different breast shapes, this can really help to ease your breasts into the right place. So I was like, okay, got this bra on, it's got side support. How firm are the actual cups? Well, the bottom part of the cup is really, really firm. There is no movement and there's no stretch in that bra whatsoever. The top of the cups has this stretch lace. And I had a lot of thoughts, you can tell. I was actually under the impression the stretch lace is really nice and you know that I am a sucker for stretch lace. I love it when it comes to fitting because it really works with a lot of breast shapes and it's really flattering and it helps if you have uneven asymmetrical breasts because instead of you having to fit to that cup, the stretch lace will kind of do its thing and sit flush against your breast without having that kind of gaping or puckering. So I was really happy to see this. But I was like, do you, will I see the lace lifting at all? And it doesn't, it sits flush against my breasts. Flush against, you can't see it. I don't know if I come closer, because I was a bit worried that you could see the lace underneath and you can't. And I actually have the Earl Grey with the pink straps. That's about as much as I'm ever gonna show you with my bra, you don't need to see anymore. So this is under white, and you can see the pink straps, but would you wear this bra under white? I wouldn't do. And talking about the straps, the straps are fully adjustable from front to back, which is wonderful for ladies that have got a shorter torso. 
This bra also has a balcony shape. So it's more like a half cup, half cut bra, which works for so many breast shapes. It works for east-west, it works for pendulous, it works for round, it works for asymmetrical. So you're covering all the shapes because not only does it have this balconette shape, but it also has the side support and the stretch lace. So Freya have done a really good job in encompassing all the different breast shapes so that this will work for you. So let's talk about the sizing of this bra. Because I know that some bras, they can be true to size. Some bras, the cups can be a little big. The band can be big or small. I wear 30Fs in pretty much all brands. And this bra feels true to size. It's not big in the band. It's not cut small in the band. The cups are not on the more generous side. They're cut to a 30F. Now I know with some Freya bras, they can be a little big in the cups. This is not one of them. It is a true to size, true to fit 30F. I'm obviously using myself as a fit model and I'm like, I am a 30F, so therefore, I am what this bra was designed for. But I just want you to know that if you're wearing a 30F in or whatever size you're wearing in other bras in the Freya range, this bra is true to size. The next thing I want to talk about are the cups. Now the bottom half of the cups appear like they're reinforced. Like I said earlier, they're not itchy. They're also not see-through at the bottom, which is great if you have a concern about them being see-through, but this bra is obviously unlined. So if you have, or you're conscious of your nipples showing, this bra would not be the style for you. Unless of course you put a, nip a nipple cover in there, then of course you could wear this bra. All in all, this bra's really comfortable, really like it, haven't got any complaints so far about it. I have worn it all day. I can move, I can twist, I can barely feel it on. It's available in a 28 to 30 D to K UK or D to O US. So this is covering a lot of sizes. If you've made it this far in the video, I'm gonna offer you a discount code. You can get 15% off this bra by quoting off beat 15. If you're interested, I will leave a link below. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Until next time, thank you and goodbye.